is the correct arrangement of letter that from words. Kind of spelling. There are A. Sounds and letter. B. Vowel and consonant. C. Digraphs, consonant, cluster, and diphthongs. D. Homopons, homograph, and homonyms. Okay, the next one is commonly confused words. The fact that English language has a lot of confused words like they either look alike, sound alike, or words of all look and sound alike. But they have completely different meanings. And all of this is just a few examples of words. Let's say a lot and a lot. A lot is a noun phrase means many, and a lot is a verb to distribute, give, or assign. And the next one is exclamation mark. It's a type of punctuation mark that goes at the end of a sentence. Using an exclamation mark when writing is rather like shouting or raising your voice when speaking. Commas, correct usage and basic rules. There's 13 point. One of them is always use comma to separate items in a series or a list. Then, use comma to addressing and to prevent possibly misreading. But don't put comma between two verbs. Use comma to separate the day of the month. Using hyphens, bracket, ellipses, and quotation marks. The first one is hyphen. There's five rules. One of them is to hyphen it between two or more adjectives before a noun. Bracket used to add additional content and use bracket to add material coded text. There's square bracket, angel bracket, and curly bracket. Ellipses primarily used in dialogue and used when words are omitted. Quotation mark used to show speech or writing by a character to emphasize word and etc.